the real, I think the real question that a lot of people ask is how do I know the timing of when I settle a personal injury case? Like when is it right to settle? Well, one, you don't rush it for sure. I guess it's gonna go one of two ways. You gotta take a look at yourself pre-accident and your life pre-accident. Then what you do is you look at yourself post-accident. Are you back to maximum improvement the way you were pre-accident? That's the goal. And the compensation parameters take all of that into consideration, pre-post. And when we're trying to determine if you've sort of gotten as well as you can after an accident, recovered as much as possible, we're not necessarily looking for somebody to be completely back to pre-accident condition, though that would be great, but sometimes that's just simply not the case. Somebody's accident is so debilitating that they will always have to live with some ramifications. In those circumstances, what we're trying to accomplish is the med maximum medical improvement possible under the circumstances, and we rely a lot on doctors, treating physicians, and experts to tell us that there is no further treatment that's going to benefit your condition. And so it's a very fact specific thing, but we have a lot of experience in sort of determining you've gone as far as you can in treatment and now is the time to try to settle this. Um, the more future looking the damages are, the harder it can be to settle. Right, and please make sure that you don't settle your case prematurely. I mentioned that earlier. If you do, or once you do, and you release out, then you are not going to be able to go back to, as I say, the well. That's gone. So let's be patient with it.